Hi, I'm Miranda, and I'm rocking the half up, half down bun thing. Let's just roll with it. Today, I'm going to be talking to you guys about my recent favorites. And a lot of these favorites, well, not a lot. Some of these I've already talked about before, but, you know, there's a reason why they're my favorites. Because I keep using them over and over again, I keep repurchasing the same things. But, first I'm going to start off with my makeup. And the first thing is the Too Faced Love Palette. I'm not sure if I've said this before. I haven't made a favorites video in a while. But, pretty good palette. All the colors are very pigmented. They blend really easily. They're very versatile. You can do many looks with just this palette alone. Let alone even more colors if you choose to use some of these colors with other palettes, of course. You can make a lot of different things with this. Um, it's $50 at Sephora or Ulta or the Too Faced website. But I'll leave the link to that below in case you're interested. I think it's great. Next is my foundation, which I've talked about this before. I know I have. And it is the Revlon Color Stay Foundation. This is probably my favorite drugstore foundation. It's not too liquidy, but it's not too thick. Ivory fits my skin tone. It's not too yellow. It's not too pink. It's not too dark. It blends really easily. And I use my Real Techniques Buffing Brush with this foundation. And... It's great. I don't need to put on any concealer over any spots unless they're like, you know, bad, then concealer helps. But other than that, it covers up any imperfections that I have very seamlessly, and I love it. Then, I have a three mascara routine now. I, I use three mascaras daily, and the first one is, of course, my Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara. This is, I've been using this for months. I have not found anything better than this so far. But, I like to team this up with the L'Oreal Power Volume 24 Hour Mascara. I, I'm pretty sure mine's just in blackest black, and this is what it looks like. And then we have the weird no name mascara that literally just says L'Oreal and has nothing else on the packaging so I have no idea what it's even called. It's just black with gold lettering. But yeah, I just use these three every day in my makeup routine. I'm pretty sure you guys have seen that but they're great. They make my lashes look awesome and I get lots of compliments on them so obviously it's doing something for me. Then the lipstick that I've been loving is the Maybelline Matte Lipstick in 655 or Daringly Nude. I've talked about this in a haul before. And it's what I'm wearing today. It's just a very nice nude lipstick. And it's matte. And I really like, I really hate shiny, sticky lipsticks. So a matte one is fantastic and perfect for me. Then, lastly for makeup, is a highlighter. And this one is by Physicians Formula. And it's just in the shade Translucent Pearl. And I've talked about this before. But it's just very shimmery. It's got pinks, golds, and like a white sheen to it. It makes an awesome glow. And then I just go ahead and top this off with my Urban Decay Illuminated Highlight in Aura. Aura. So those two together just... I love my highlights, man. It's great. Moving on to a hair product. It is just by Macadamia Professional. It is a weightless moisture leaving conditioning mist. It smells really, really nice. I like it a lot. I'm going to have to figure out where I can get a new bottle from because it's almost gone. And I actually really do like it. And this, I got this in my one of my birch boxes that I get monthly. But... Yeah, I like it a lot, so it's been helping my hair out a lot too. Then, lastly, I have three candles, 
and they're all from Bath and Body Works. The first one is black teakwood, and it just, I really enjoy cologne smelling candles. Um, the mahogany teakwood is just like this one. Then there's a candle called New York, and that also smells like cologne. But it is very strong. It makes my room smell awesome, and I love it a lot. The second one is another cologne smelling one. It is called Citrin Cedarwood, and it's just orange. I just... I love the smell of boy. Boys smell awesome when they try to. And I, I'm in love. I just love the smell of boy. <laughs> then the last one is a one of the pumpkin scented candles. And this one is pumpkin spiced cheesecake. Also very strong. It definitely makes its way around an entire room. Um, it's, not a, it's not too strong. It just, when you walk into a room where this is burning, it just smells wonderful. And the other pumpkin candles do smell really nice. I like the marshmallow one too. I think it's, I don't remember what it's called. It's pumpkin something marshmallow. It might be spice. I don't remember. But it's just really, really good. And I like it. But that is all of my favorites as of right now. News. I have something to tell you guys that's kind of weird. And first... I met a boy that's weird. He is not my boyfriend, but boy, pretty cool. Um, along with boy, I'm going to be on an album cover for Boy's Band. So that is getting released on this upcoming Sunday on the 20th. So I'll leave a link to that below once it's out because I've heard all the songs on it. I think they're great. No, I'm not just saying that. Their songs are very catchy. I like them. And then along with that, I'm going to be in a music video for them. So also, when that gets released, I'm not sure when. But I will leave a link to it down in this video's description once it's released. Also, in upcoming video descriptions, I think, depending on when it gets done, I'm not too sure, but just because we're not done filming yet, and they've got to edit and get all the other shots done too, so when that's all finished, I will leave the link to that down here too. So that's weird, but exciting, and I hope you guys like it, because... Supporting bands is cool. <laughs> but yeah, that's really all I have for you guys today. I'm um, just very happy, very in a good mood vibe. Oh! Just remember, my lights. I got new lights for Halloween, I just remember. Um, I got them from Target. I have just purple ones and then some pumpkin ones, as you can see. I will insert a clip of what they look like at night because they're very cute and I like them a lot. But yeah, I hope you guys are looking forward to more videos. I have some fall ones filmed but not edited yet. Um, if you want more fall outfits, I can do that. I plan to once it gets colder out. Yeah, a lot of good things are in the works. So, I hope you guys enjoy this video. This is long, but I will see you in my next one. Bye!